It's all right. I know everything, and it doesn't make a bit of difference. What are you talking about? You were probably very young, and anyone can make a mistake. What? No apologies, no explanations, please. I'll only be in town a short while, and the sadder but wiser girl for me. Will you please make your selection and leave? I have. Well, what do you want to take out? The librarian. Quiet, please. The librarian. You're not listening, Marion. Look. Marion. Marbles. Six Steelies, eight Aggies, a dozen Peewees, and one big glassy with an American flag in the middle. I think I'll drop it. No! Shh! Madam Librarian. Well, what can I do, my dear, to catch your ear? I love you madly, madly, Madam Librarian. Marion, heaven help us, if the library caught on fire and the volunteer host brigade men had to whisper the news to Marion. Madam Librarian. What can I say, my dear, to make it clear? I need you badly, badly, Madam Librarian. Marion, if I stumbled and I busted my whatchamacallit, I could lie on your floor unnoticed till my body had turned to hair. Madam Librarian. Now in the moonlight, a man could sing it. In the moonlight You'll know that his darling Had heard every word of his song With the moonlight Helping along Whoa! But when I try in here To tell you, dear I love you madly, madly, madam librarian Marianne, it's a long lost cause never win, for the civilized world accepts as unforgivable sin, and he's talking out loud with an librarian, such as Marion, Madam Librarian.
I love you madly, madly, mad in librarian. Marion, it's a long lost cause. I can never win. But the civilized world accepts as a forgivable sin. And you're talking out loud with an librarian such as Marion. Lady Stance Committee meets Tuesday nights. Madam Librarian. Marshmallow. Thank <laughs> you.